everyone, my name is Michelle and I do five star book reviews. Thank you for watching everyone. I am so excited to talk about this book that I am sitting here sweating. It is 90 degrees in my house because I haven't had AC in three days, but it gets fixed tomorrow. So I'm glistening a little bit, okay? But I, I had to do this video, right? I had to because I'm talking about Catherine Center's newest book, Things You Save in a Fire. My god this is such a good book I can't, I can't I can't even tell you that's why I had to do this video even though I'm sitting here sweating like crazy hoping that you can't see it <laughs> but you probably can but anyway ready let's go 320 pages women's fiction so far on it's been out a week from tomorrow and it has already 289 five-star reviews on Amazon. Is that amazing? I am so happy for her because I love her so much. And I'm gonna put, I interviewed her when she came out with her book last year called How to Walk Away. It was a num It was already on New York Times bestseller like so quick that this one, I just know this week, this book is going to be on the New York Times. That's why I'm like, do the video. Sweat and do the video. So here I am, all right? We are talking main character, Cassie Hanwell. She is a firefighter and up on your screen so you don't have to watch me sweat too much. I got, ready? One of the year's most anticipated books by USA Today, The Washington Post and The Hollywood Reporter. Unbelievable. Jodi Picoult, which I always say her name like that and I'm not even sure if that's right. Oh, how I love Catherine Center's writing and her newest novel is a gem. Just read it and thank me later. Yes, Jody, I agree. Brene Brown, Catherine Center writes about falling down, finding love, and growing up like nobody else. I agree. I so agree. I love her books so much, okay? So, ready? First line, the night I became the youngest person and the only female ever to win the Austin Fire Department's Valor Award I got propositioned by my partner and this book I love Catherine's books you learn so much okay so I learned so much about the firefighting world and if I'm not mistaken like she I think she's a doctor or a paramedic something because her books always have so much medical stuff but just enough that I don't get creeped out because some books I read and it's like so much medical terminology and I'm like, I don't even know what they're talking about. Catherine doesn't do that, okay? She takes you into her world and she explains it to even like people like me who never understand any of that, okay? So anyway, you have to get this book. I just know it. It's going to be on the New York Times bestseller so quick, okay? And you want to be one of those people that's like, I already read it. It's up there, but I already read it. I spent the weekend reading it. It's only 320 pages. And Catherine, we love you. And I even read somewhere that, I'm trying to think where, that not How to Walk Away, but one of her other books is becoming a movie. But I think How to Walk Away is becoming a movie too. And this one should be a movie. All her books should be a movie. Just saying. If there's anything I can do to make that happen, Catherine, I will, okay? I love you. I love your writing. It was such a joy to read. I'm gonna put down below the IndieBound, the Amazon links. Go get this book. And can we talk about this cover for just a second? Her covers, I'm gonna put How to Walk Away. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put them like side by side so you can see how amazing they are. She has the most beautiful covers and you just know it. Like you just know that that's what it's gonna be. How to Walk Away was amazing. And then this one, I was like, how can you do better? You can't, uh, only you can do better, all right? So Catherine, you did it again. You did it again. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. I loved it. I loved Cassie. I love how you write about relationships. We have mother, daughter, father, daughter, romantic, co-workers. She covers it all and nobody writes relationships like she does. So can't wait to see what everyone says. Leave me a comment below when you read it. If you're going to read it, please go read it. And until my next book, and I won't be sweating, I promise, cool air is coming. Until my next book, everyone, have a great night.